goaded Linux distros. Oh, we're starting to get deep here, boys. I3. What's I3? I3 is a tiling windows manager and one of the best windows manager out there if you don't want to use a mouse. It's for keyboard only, for those hackers, for those code nerds. Pros for I3. I3 is lightweight and fast. I3 is also a tiling windows manager, meaning that each window you pull up pops into its own separate space on the desktop. Very useful if you're writing code or working on configurations. I3 is also highly configurable. In fact, it has one config file that you edit and then restart the DE with to apply changes. I3 is also scriptable and modular, meaning that you can, if you know how, write your own customizations for it. Downside to i3, it is not for beginners. It's not easy. It is a mouse unfriendly desktop environment. So get good before you start using i3 or start using i3 to get good, you know, whatever works. Another downside is i3 has a pretty minimal interface. There's no desktop, there's no icons, there's no status bar. Can you add those? Yes but it's something you have to manually go in and configure. That might be a pro for you. Also, i3 does not have a lot of eye candy. There's no fancy animations. There's no fancy icons. It's just to get work done. So if you're a developer, you're an administrator, you're a minimalist, i3 is for you. If you just want something that works, I don't advise it. As always, thank you for watching. If you'd like to see more, please go ahead and subscribe either here or at my YouTube channel up above. We're gonna be dropping more content over there on YouTube, some long form stuff. Otherwise, thank you for watching. Enjoy your day, boys.